And it's so exciting to be here today on this bright and sunny Tuesday afternoon with everyone here. We're very excited to be bringing a brand new product line here to India. Me A1. Any phone really starts with one thing, which is premium design. It's got to look good and it's got to feel good. And Mi A1 checks the box on both of these. We're going to take a look at our first glimpse of Mi A1. Starting out here with the black version of Mi A1, just taking the glance at the first, at the top half of the back section. You can see the dual camera here. Let's take a look at the front. So here you can see the same back portion that we just saw in conjunction with the lower half of the front. It's made entirely from aluminum. And it's got comfortably rounded back edges, so it fits perfectly in your hand. So Mi A1 will be coming in three different colors, black, rose gold, and gold. It has a large 5.5 inch full HD screen and it's protected by Corning Gorilla Glass so you never have to worry about accidentally scratching up the phone and then saying like, oh no, scratched up my phone. <laughs> it's very, very slim. It's just over seven millimeters in thickness. And it's very light at only 165 grams. So this phone by far has been the easiest phone for me to use with just one hand. And combined with the rounded back edges, it has spectacular hand feel. So multitasking with one hand is an absolute breeze. And all three colors have been designed to be highly fingerprint resistant. The Mi A1 design in summary, full metal body with discrete separation lines seamlessly blending into the body of the phone and rounded edges for amazing hand feel. So Mi A1 comes with a flagship dual camera. So today, there are about three different mainstream camera solutions in the market today. On the very far left, we have a color plus color combination that was first introduced in 2014 and is currently used in a couple of models like the Lenovo K8 Note. And in the middle, we have an RGB plus monochrome, a black and color version. And this is used today in a couple of models like the Moto G5S. And on the far right, we have the most premium solution available today, which is a wide angle lens paired with a telephoto lens. And of course, that's the one that Mi A1 uses. Zoom in a little bit, no pun intended. You can see here, the telephoto lens is responsible for zooming in, really giving a close-up shot, while the wide-angle lens helps us get a very wide and panoramic shot. Let's see how it looks like on the Mi A1. So the Mi A1 flagship dual camera setup packs a 12-megapixel, 50-millimeter telephoto lens and a 26-millimeter, 12-megapixel wide-angle lens. And you can see they just lie on the body of the phone, very, very beautiful. And this together, thank you, thank you. And this together delivers a DSLR quality experience that you can put right in your pocket. This flagship dual camera setup, is the same that we find in top flagship phones like the iPhone 7 Plus, A1, with large 1.25 micron pixels which let in over 56% more light than pixels found in typical smartphone cameras. 56%. And it produces images that are clearly brighter and more expressive. This photo was actually taken by Mi A1. You can see how sharply in focus the lady is while everything else in the background is beautifully blurred. Mi A1 uses our 50 millimeter telephoto lens to really capture the main image and our 26 millimeter wide angle lens to assist with depth of field measurement. And when we combine it with our stereoscopic imaging and deep learning algorithm, we're able to produce 
these bokeh effects that are very DSLR-like in nature. So this is your first glance of Mi A1 going head-to-head -head with other flagship phones, like the iPhone 7 Plus and the OnePlus 5. On the left here, we have the iPhone 7 Plus. In the middle, we have the OnePlus 5. And on the right, we have Mi A1. Now, all three of these photos are beautifully shot. But if you asked me, Donovan, which one do you enjoy the most? I think I'm going to have to go with the Mi A1. It's beautifully caught. It's beautifully shot. The background is very blurred. Let's take a look at some details here. You'll see in the background blur that the Mi A1 has what we call bokeh lights. They're these little circles of light that occur when you blend together the light and blur in a certain way. And as you can see on the very far left, the iPhone 7 Plus in this case did not capture the bokeh lights. The subjects are all very extremely clear, but if we zoom in a little bit more to detect the edges of the right sleeve, we'll see here the Mi A1 has very clearly defined edges, while the OnePlus 5 and the iPhone 7 Plus have some blurring of the edge of the screen. So this is another hallmark of having very good bokeh shots in a DSLR-like format. Let's take a look at a second shot of comparison shots. You can see here they're all three very beautiful shots again in terms of color reproduction. But if we zoom in a little bit more, you can see that the Mi A1 again accurately detects a lot of edges, especially when it comes to the hair. You see the OnePlus 5 didn't quite fare as well in this particular set of shots. And even the iPhone 7 Plus, you can see there's some jaggedness and blurriness when it comes to the hair. taking picture-perfect shots with great digital bokeh in the background. Superior quality, 2x optical zoom, even at long distances, and large 1.25 micron pixels to ensure bright and expressive picture quality. So Mi A1 is powered by the Qualcomm Snapdragon 625. So here's the Mi A1 audio performance summary. 10 volt smart power amplifier, DHS audio calibration algorithm, standalone audio amplifier, and powers high impedance headphones. It's just an unparalleled audio listening experience. Is that all? No. We're delivering greater and better user experience by adding further customizations just for our global markets. Starting from India, all Mi A1 phones will come with a dual pyrolytic graphite sheet. What does that mean, you may ask? Well, it helps to diffuse and radiate heat quickly so you don't have to worry about your phone temperature going too high. And if you compare this to typical phones that only have a single pyrolytic graphite sheet, it effectively reduces the temperature by up to two degrees Celsius. Mi A1 comes with a USB Type-C port. So on top of all these customizations, Mi A1 also has infrared. So you can use it with our Mi Remote app that comes pre-installed with Mi A1 making it extremely easy and convenient to manage all of your household appliances and other devices. Very proud to announce today that Mi A1 is created by Xiaomi and powered by Google. That's right. What is the price? What will Mi A1 retail for? Take a look at the other phones that we've compared Mi A1 to in this entire presentation. For a Mi A1 with 4 GB of RAM and 64 GB of storage. Any guesses? 
We've also partnered with Airtel and will be giving all new and existing customers using Mi A1 up to 200 GB of additional 4G data for free.